Yeah, hello everybody and welcome back and hope you guys are doing well and we'll be continuing with our previous uh, classes and uh, uh, today we'll be going and see how to do our table relation and for that we need a two table and we already have a product table from our previous video and I have also added another new table which is T price and also I have added a, a three uh, fields which is unit price and item ID so price table would be our uh, uh, child table and the parent table would be our product table so let's go to our child table which is uh, tree price and add a new relation so new relation and just give a name as a product ID and I will choose a table so when we choose a table we have to choose a parent table create our normal relation and on the field we will choose as a item ID which is from our product table and related field we will be choosing as a same item ID from our price uh, table so you can see here key price that item ID is equals to uh, product dot uh, item ID so we have created a new relation from uh, which is related from a product table or a price table that item uh, it should take to product table that item so this two table is not related so our product is a, a parent and charge is our price so just save it and now open it and we'll add a new row and now you can see here it's a drop down by default so when we create a relationship, we will have a drop down or combo box. So you can select the item directly from your uh, parent table, which will be our product table. So I just add this one and price will be 10. And you need to say button and save it. So now you have a uh, new uh, new row in a price table. So let me add a new new row and uh, let me add a new item that is going to be in our uh, product table. So when you try to add a new product uh, ID that is or item ID that is not uh, already there in our uh, parent table, so you can get a Error that the value field item ID is not found in a related table, uh, which is our product table. So, so, whatever you want to add in the child table, that that field or uh, that item ID, what we related is the item ID, right? We created the relation item ID. So, if you want to add an uh, item ID to our price table, so that item ID must exist in our parent table which would be our product table so if you don't have a uh, item ID that is in a product table and you are trying to add into your price table uh, it will not allow you since there is a relation between uh, child and parent relation between two tables so I think I uh, hope you understand this video and uh, thanks guys and thank you for watching